not not entirely sure on that one. That the verdict, you know, the jury's still out. Yeah, well I'm excited to see what does actually happen if I do that into the Aatrox. I saw a tweet earlier, I can't remember by who. Someone mentioned Where Griffin wanna be playing. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh, Dread with the face check. He's gonna get the Scryer's Bloom off, but there is no ultimate available. He wants to get to this wall. Will Flash actually hops over as Jovi flashes in. That's the Colossal Smash. That's a yikes. Which is so surprising. And then right here, Sword coming for a control oh. ward. Now the weird thing is, is that Sword's going- Jelly's Unbreakable keeps him very safe though. Is okay guys. Looking for the dive, Sun can just put the claw right through the wall. Is going to get the nice double snare, and Viper, not long for the world, will be... This is the way that you break down a Freak of Freaks. How is Keen? Is Keen all right? Is he having a good time? Yeah. And uh, he certainly is. As, uh, Sun is certainly not. That's the quickness to come in as well, and that is the last axe. Griffin can team fight sometimes, but she's oh, no man. Scion, as the Freak of Freaks have started off Shelly. Sun standing on top of a ward. I don't know whether he actually knows that, as they are trying to get Tarzan in there. They will be able to take down the Rift Herald, as now Keen's just dancing around in the middle of this fight. Really great quickness to come in from Lahans, as the team fight's looking good for Griffin, but Keen is so big on the backline. Lamstra's fight will buy some time, as Dread is just going to get shot with the ultimate from Sword. And Afrika Freaks are going to continue trying to win this fight. Viper dancing around the backside, but Tarzan can't re-enter. Sword also struggling to re-enter this fight as Keen is just tearing apart this Griffin lineup. Great slowdown, that's going to be another one, a double kill for Keen. And the Aatrox is well and truly fed. Yeah, the Aatrox is absolutely massive right now. Oh, Sword. Oh my goodness, I've seen this one before. This is not the, one of the leaning phase moves. Oh! There's any... Keen's going to be able to take down the first turret, and he's only going to get bigger oh, from man. here. We'll see whether this is going to be enough bad guys. In order to take him down already, it's a pretty decent start here for Sword. Good knock up as the World Ender is going to be utilized. Keen should get taken down into that passive. Unable to do quite enough damage just yet in order to win a one versus three. Whoa. You know when you play a platform game, you just want you want to be able to like move fluidly oh. throughout the world. Gonna have to hold that thought as that is a gigantic three-man taunt from Chovy. Lamsra's fight does go down though, and Viper's gonna make his way into this fight. Dread is able to hop his way out, but leaves them at a man disadvantage. His son's gonna be taken down, and Griffin, have they done it again? Have they found the team fight? Justice punch to get Chovy out of harm's way, and Griffin Ooh. just circling the drain at the moment. Good double stun there as Dread's gonna get knocked up, but he does create a safe distance here. Dance of Arrows comes forward. There's the Lamsra's fight. Keeps him alive for a very long time. Hero's entrance, good timing there as they slam dunk the Braum. Afrika are just getting melted, but Sword's gonna get taken down. No, he's not! The Valor Shield is in, and he's just baited them for so incredibly long. Finally goes down, but the damage is honestly oh. being done. Oh my goodness. Aiming. The Winions, the Winions, and we've oh, got Keen Lahans. still alive as well. Lahans is gonna bite the bullet there, and no more minions remaining. This will be an open Nexus, and this will be Griffin's third game loss in a row, and a game one loss to the Afrika Freaks of all teams. Hold on, it's not over yet. Not quite. Chovy oh, looking to man. make his way forward. That's going to be the ult onto Sword. Not exactly the greatest target now as Viper is going to get challenged by Keen. The Condemn is fantastic. Infernal Chains, not quite enough as he goes down into the World Ender. It's a one for one so far as Sun does go down and Aiming's just tearing apart. This Griffin roster, it's an open Nexus and it should be a game one victory oh, for the Lamp Afrika respite. Freaks. Lamb's Respite guarantees it. And Afrika, that is a beautiful game number one and a very unexpected win.